Big day in London. Oliver is a taxi driver in Paris. He works for top taxis. I like to drive. One day Oliver's boss, Jack, telephones him. It is very early in the morning, Oliver, says Jack. Can you be at the Ritz Hotel at 9.00 o'clock? Yes, says Oliver, but why? Jack and his wife are having breakfast with their children, Billy and Katie. Sigourney Weaver is in Paris, says Jack. Sigourney Weaver, says Oliver. The film star. Where do you want me to drive her? Not her, says Jack. Him. Her 12-year-old son Max wants to see Paris today. His mother's working. There's a letter for you at the Ritz. There's 50, too. That's for Max. 50 for one day in Paris, says Oliver. That's a lot of money. I know, says Jack. Be very nice to the boy, Oliver, and don't be late. You know me, says Oliver. I'm always early. It is 8.45. Oliver is at the Ritz 15 minutes early. He goes to the desk. I'm from Top Taxis, he says. The woman behind the desk gives him the letter and the money. The letter says, it's Max's first time in Paris. Please take him to all these places, 1. Buckingham Palace, 2. Harrods, 3. The British Museum. Okay, thanks Oliver. Now, is Max here? I know I'm early, but, he sees a boy in a chair. Hello, he says. Are you Max? That's me says the boy. Are you the driver from Top Taxis? Yes, answers Oliver. The boy stands up. Okay, he says. Let's go. First, Oliver drives to Buckingham Palace, the home of the Queen. He stops the taxi. What are you doing? Asks Max, I don't want to see this old place. Oliver looks at him. But I, then he remembers Jack's words, be very nice to the boy. Okay, Max, he says. Where do you want to go? Five minutes later Oliver stops the taxi again. Is this the place? He asks. That's right, answers Max, can I have twenty, please? But I don't think your mother. I want twenty. Now. Oliver gives Max the money. Then he sits in the car and waits. Three hours later, Max comes back. Now, are you hungry? asks Oliver. Yes, I am, answers Max, very hungry. Oliver drives to Harrods. There's a very good restaurant in this shop, he says. I don't want to eat here, says Max, I want to have lunch there. Where? asks Oliver. He looks across the road. Max goes into the big burger bar with another twenty. He eats a mountain of food and drinks four milkshakes. Oliver eats his lunch in the taxi. Twenty for lunch, he thinks. I can buy a week's food with twenty. He looks out of the window and eats another sandwich.
An hour later Max comes out of the restaurant. Be very nice to the boy, thinks Oliver. Do you want to go to the British Museum now? He asks. Okay, answers Max. Oliver looks at him. Yes. Oliver is very happy. He drives to the British Museum and gives Max ten. Thanks, says Max. Wait here. Then he goes into a cinema across the road from the museum. At 4.15 Max comes out of the cinema. Oliver is sitting in the cab. He is very angry. Where do you want to go now? He asks. Oh, back to the Ritz, I think, says Max. I'm tired and I want to have a bath before dinner. Good, thinks Oliver. Oliver starts the car again. At 4.30 Oliver stops in front of the hotel. Here we are, he says. He opens the door for Max. Then he sees a beautiful woman in a very expensive coat. She is walking out of the Ritz and she is looking at him. I know that woman, thinks Oliver. Then he remembers. Of course, it's Sigourney Weaver. Are you the man from Top Taxis? asks Gloria. Yes, says Oliver. Come with me, says the film star. She walks back into the hotel. There, Oliver sees a boy sitting in a chair. He looks very sad. This is Max, she says. But, but, Oliver can't speak. I am very angry, says Gloria. Oliver looks at the boy, at the film star, and at the young boy again. But this can't be Max, he says. Young man, I know my son, answers Gloria. Now, where is my fifty? Oliver's face goes white. He looks out of the window. His taxi is there, but Max is not. It is 5.00 o'clock in the afternoon. Oliver's boss, Jack, is at home. He and his wife are having a cup of tea. The door opens and their son, Billy, walks in. Hello, Billy, says Jack. Good day at school. Billy looks very happy. Yes, thanks, he says. Very good.